приємно покликати до мікрофону пані Мері Дерос, котра є заступником посадника міста Монтреалю і представником округи Парк Екстеншн в міській раді. Я її прошу до слова. Пліз. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Bonsoir, mesdames et messieurs. Reverend fathers, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen. It's an honor and privilege for me to join you this evening in celebrating Ukraine's renewed independence and celebrating the 23rd anniversary. And also to have the opportunity to hear an amazing woman speak, Mrs. Miroslava Gongadz. Despite the personal tragedy that Mrs. Gongadz has faced, she has remained a tireless champion for human rights and freedoms of the press in her native Ukraine. Um, at this time, I'd like to also say that I am part Armenian. Next year, the Armenian community around the world will be celebrating the 100th anniversary to commemorate the genocide of 1915. And uh, I am a daughter of victims of the genocide. Mrs. Gongadz is a shining example for her daughters and for us all. Thank you, Mrs. Gongadz, for all that you have done for humanity. <laughs> the ongoing crisis in eastern Ukraine has been a cause for concern for many of you worrying about the well-being of family and friends. Please know that our mayor, mayor of Montreal, Mr. Denis Coderre, and the city of Montreal are with you in thoughts and prayers during these difficult times. A few months ago, when I was approached by members of your community to see if the mayor of Montreal would consider raising the Ukrainian flag at City Hall, I remember how quickly and without hesitation that the mayor and the members of the executive committee agreed to do so in solidarity with the hardships your families back home experienced. <laughs> Montreal is home to over 220 different cultural communities and just in Park Extension alone, the a district that I represent of 40,000 residents we have 110 different cultural communities, and these people, these communities work side by side, regardless of their differences back home, political differences, at least here in Montreal, in Park X as well. They live in harmony and in respect of one another. Many have fled their homelands and left their political differences behind in order to build a better life here to live in harmony. Please know that we value the contribution the, the Ukrainian community has made to our social, economic, and cultural fabric of our wonderful city. You are a wonderful community, and I thank you for sharing your history and heritage with us. Together, we can build bridges, strive for peace, and build a better world for the generations to come. Thank you, and have a good evening. Happy anniversary on your independence. Thank you very much, Mrs. Deros, for your kind and warm words and for your support within our municipal structure within the city of Montreal for the Ukrainian community of Montreal and in the broader sense for Ukrainians everywhere. Thank you. Monsieur Guillaume Lavoie est le conseiller du district Rosemont La Petite Patrie, notre conseiller de notre communauté ici en Rosemont à la ville de Montréal. Monsieur Levoix. Merci beaucoup. Euh, bienvenue à, à Rosemont. Et bien sûr, une très joyeuse fête d'indépendance à vous tous. A very happy Independence Day to you all. Um, let me just say that uh, before I got into politics, I spent a good uh, share of my life abroad. And through various work, notably election observation, I had the chance three times 
to visit uh, Ukraine. First to the west in Lviv, and then to uh, the south in Yetopetrovska. I hope I said that right. Uh, and of course, uh, the most marking experience of all when I was sent to the very border on the east in Luhansk and Donetsk, those cities where I sadly hear the names every night on the news now. I was there in 04 during the Orange Revolution, and I was very, very proud to have been part or to have played even a minor part in this incredible awakening that was happening then. So there is an even greater sorrow when I see the events today. But I'm even more determined now, uh, and if history serves us well, you know, remember uh, what President Kennedy once said, those who foolishly sell power by riding the back of the tiger ended up inside. So history is on our side, definitely on this one. <clears throat> Thank you. And so when I became a city councillor, uh, of course there's a city council where I sit, but I was also the borough council. And I ask and request and obtain that now every time we sit, there is a flag of the city of Montreal, and given that the Ukrainian community is mostly uh, here in the borough of Rosemont, that there is a flag of Ukraine in the borough council, and will remain there as long as I have a seat in that council. And, and since we uh, had a prayer uh, before we began, and we are accompanied by Reverend Fathers, I was thinking, you know, this old quotation, is there a blessing for the Tsar? Well, of course there is. May God bless him and keep the Tsar far away from us. <laughs> so, I'd just love to, you, I'd love to leave you with these words which I said in the borough council, and I said the city council, and I'm very proud to stand here and say to you today, Yachotiv bi Vislovsti, zvoju solidarnist, z narodom Ukraini. Slava Ukraini. Thank you very much. Thank you, Monsieur Lavois, for your kind words, for your warm words, and the Ukrainian community being centered here in Rosemount. I believe that we can officially declare you an honorary citizen of our community today. Thank you. Всім українським матерям я хочу присвятити наступну пісню. Пісня про матір. Посіяла людям літа свої літечка жито, прибрала планету, послала стежка з поришу, навчила дітей, як на світі по совісті жити. Зітхнула полегко і тихо пішла за межу. Куди ж це ви, мамо, з полохано кинулись діти? Куди ж ви, бабусю, онуки спішать до ворі? Та я недалечко, де сон? Це заходить спочити, поранені дітки, а ви вже без мене ростіть. Та як же без вас ми, та що ж ви намислили, мамо? А хто ж нас, бабусю, у сон поведе по казкам? Та я вам лишаю сірай ти журавлями, і срібло у травах, і золото на колосках. 
Не треба нам райду, не треба нам срібла і злата, аби тільки ви нас чекали завжди край порід, та ми переробимо усе. Вона посміхнулась, красива і сива, мов доля, змахнула рукою, злетіли увесь рушники, лишайте щасливі. Лишайтесь щасливі.